It does, a uniform does not give you the right you to be racist. You better elders because you're disrespecting me. You're now. disrespecting her. You want to bet? When you're in America, you better learn our language. You don't come up with somebody. You want to bet? Yeah. I you want to bet? Too. Seriously? Yes, I was. Not like you were us. very racist to that woman. No, I was not. You should just leave. No, you should leave and get her away you from me. Leave. I'm not leaving until you problem. leave. You should leave. Just get her away from me. Roger that. It's called the First Amendment, ma'am. He's just losing it. That's it. He's gone. Bye. Well, the good thing is he told me where he works, so that's a good thing bye. I'm going to call. God bless you. Go to church, will you? You need some prayer. <laughs> God has Bye. nothing to do with is your this actions. like in that show? Okay, what do what do same. you do? I'll do the is, is same. It's a no talk show. Yeah. Your Bye. Your Bye. Your Bye. You're a very racist man. You want to bet? Why would you say that to I'm her? I'm a Just Christian. I'll tell you why. Because you couldn't communicate with her. Because they murdered 343 of my fellow firemen. That's why. September 11, 2001. That's why. That has nothing to do with you her. You want to bet? That has nothing to Learn do. with Learn English. Her. It's America. It's so not Spain. Or call the and it's not Mexico. Get away from me. I'm not. Look, get away from me, man. I said get away from me. Get away from If me. you're close enough that I can do that, get then you're too close. Get away from me. Now, I know that your first reaction after watching that video is to attack this man, but he, he is doing an important service. Too many forget about all that the Spanish got away with on 9-11. <laughs> so, like, I don't know. Okay, so so that's it's a, it's a male care and a firefighter at a Walmart in Nebraska. It's also the most cordial interaction at that Walmart in Nebraska that day uh, simultaneously. So um, what you saw there was a guy who had been harassing an employee for not speaking English. I thought for a second the guy was speaking Arabic maybe? Cuz the guy was confused about 9-11, but he's confused about a great many things. Apparently you cannot be a racist or Ivana if you're a firefighter or if you're a Christian. I think those <laughs> things have some correlation actually. But anyway, um, what do you think about the, what you saw in that video? I think that he used the conservative Trump card. They called him racist for being racist. And he said, no, I'm not. I'm not being a racist. Just denying like <laughs> what everyone is seeing with their own eyes. It's, uh, it's conservatives favorite move. But I just, one, he says that he's an LA firefighter. He's in Nebraska. Why was he at 9-11? Was he there? Did he actually okay. see this? Maybe he knows more information about us. Maybe he saw it was actually it was actually Spain that did it. Yeah, look, if he actually served and was in the towers on 9-11 and got out, I get why you would be really affected by that. Doesn't excuse being racist and doubling down once you realize you're being filmed. It doesn't explain how your answer to literally every question would be wanna bet. Like <laughs> you're a racist, no I'm not, wanna bet. That's not how bets work. I don't like <laughs> you seem biased. I don't think I'm gonna be able to acquire information with that because now money's on the line. So I don't know. It's not a fair bet anyway. But that said, it also wasn't the end of the interaction. So let's get to a little bit more of what happened in this Walmart. You should be shaken. I and am. when someone doesn't speak English and we can't communicate in Los Angeles, guess what happens? Honest. People die. People go bye bye. Bruce, he's like walking up on us and stuff. Oh, he actually has gone to my face. Now you're going to lie? No. Okay, so if you're in a fire and you're not speaking English, then you can die. So presumably the fireman busts into the burning room and he's like, do you need help? And they say, see, and he says, I don't know what you want out of me. And he just walks away, I guess. I don't understand how any of that's supposed to work. I'm not a fireman though. Everyone who doesn't speak English has died in a fire. There's <laughs> anyone who lives in non-English speaking countries, uh, it, you know, you better hope and pray that, you know, your house never sets on fire because that's it. That's the end. Yeah, Apparently, yeah. Course, he's, a, he's a fireman. I trust him. He knows what he's talking about. <laughs> okay. 
Check out the Damage Report podcast each day, wherever you get your podcasts, whether Pocket Casts or Stitcher or iTunes. You can join me as I give you the news and stories you want with a range of co-hosts and interview guests jumping in on the fun each day. Again, that's the Damage Report, wherever you get your podcasts. And if you get them at iTunes, don't forget to rate and review. Sometimes I'll read them live on the show.